Hello, I'm Deaconess London with a word of wisdom today. I would like to take the time to wish you a very blessed and a spirit-filled 2024. We know that according to Mark 4 from verse 35 to 41, when Jesus was with his disciples and he said to them, let us cross over on the other side, because where they were, the time was up for them to move to another location. But I want us to take note to two important points of the command that was given. The first, let us go over. And the second, to the other side. In the first command, Jesus said to them, let us. So that was telling them that they were not going to cross over to their new destination alone. Jesus was already with them, crossing over. They didn't know what they were going to encounter on the crossover, but Jesus knew, and he had already fulfilled his promise to them. Hallelujah. After Jesus was through teaching his disciples on the parables, he instructed them, let's go over to the other side. When Jesus said to the other side, he meant there was going to be a change or a shift. One thing we must note is that Jesus never told them what they would encounter during the crossover. He did not tell them that it will be a smooth sail. Nevertheless, he did reveal to them that their final destination would undeniably be the other side. Many times in our lives, as we navigate the seas of life, we too confront boisterous storms that appear to detour us from our final destination. Our actions during these times may mirror the responses of the disciples when they thought they were going to die at sea. The word had been planted and the disciples had gladly received it. But when the storm came, the word had not taken root and it caused them to be faithless. We too must always hold on to the promises of God as we endeavor to reach the other side of our victory, our breakthrough, our healing, or the other side of our answered prayers. I want to encourage you for this new year, 2024, that Jesus didn't promise to calm every storm, but he has promised that he will never leave us and never forsake us, those who trust in him, regardless of the stormy winds that will batter us, his word and promises to us is already accomplished in the mighty name of Jesus. Let us cross over on the other side. God bless you.